Well, howdy. Here we are later on that day with a little reveal. There she is, ladies and gentlemen. Almost perfectly camouflaged. Appropriate part still showing. I'm going to have to cut this little edge right here for my fuel gauge to show because all the metal's in the right place, the rubber is not, and that's fine. That's a little small detail. There we got the other. Turned out what I didn't need any cushioning here. I did plan for some. And uh this clamping force is gonna be enough to keep this in place. And then for the coup de gras, here we go. <laughs> Seven thousand watts of pure sine wave power. I got a deal on this one. It was the last one of its kind for the new model. I paid forty-five hundred dollars for this thing. Cash on the barrel head. Sunny beaches. And yes, I have tested it, and it does run both of those freezes right there. I might even go get a third one here in about a week or so. This thing's quiet. Oh my god, this thing's so quiet. And look, I kind of got the whole panel relatively paint free. Come back with a little razor cut and uh, maybe some solvent. Clear that up right there. Well, I don't even fucking care, really. Nobody's ever going to really ever notice. Gosh, there's it. That's it. Got the backside. So when you're from a distance, someone really knows what they're looking at, they know what they're looking at. But in that, it's kind of subdued because it's all white just like the truck. It's not as glaringly obvious that there's a $5,000 generator on the back there. Which is my whole intent. So, I'm happy. And um, tomorrow, I'm gonna take off in the morning and I'm head to uh, my wholesalers and fill that one right up there with ice cream and that one there with ice cream. And um, hopefully, I'll have all my stickers ready by noon and applied right here. And I'm heading to my marketplace. I want to hit Spartanburg, South Carolina. Have a good old day. We'll see how that turns out. This thing is so fucking awesome. Oh my god. 18 hours on one tank. Five gallons. All right, let's go up. Let's go back in the house and upload this video. I might come on here later on. I might be busy printing stickers out. I've really been putting that off all day. I just need to be able to concentrate on um, what all items I want to take from that particular distributor. And then I'll have to wait till I get to the other two distributors and, and, and um, determine what I want from them. And I'll also have to figure out what I want to get from Sam's Club and what I'm going to get from Ingalls. And um, we'll move along from there. And hopefully you're having a great day because I know I am. I got to get all this crap. Um, oh, that's I'll, I almost forgot. I need to remind myself tomorrow I got to buy five more coolers like that and fill them up with um, all the Red Bulls and all the Monster Energy and um, cases upon cases of Fiji water. I will only sell Fiji water. And uh, I need to make stickers for those too. And get those applied right over yonder. Right, there you go, Brian. There's a kind of what this looks like right there. I've got a few more details I want to hammer out, but um, this is fine right here. Um, 
uh, I can live without those other details right now. I just need to get rolling, but I do want to be continuing throwing a couple hundred dollars every week into this thing and um, uh, you know, just little details here and there. Yeah, she's ready to roll right now. Pretty much what all mostly what I need. Got my chrome rims. Oh, the chrome rims. They're they're polished aluminum. I got uh, I got 100 feet of this, 150 feet of this coming along. I'll probably pull this off and put some new down, and then uh, a lot more, a lot everywhere else. I, I want to be seen. Uh, probably have this whole rail right here on both sides, all the way down, and then uh, all the way across there, all the way right across there, all the way across the top, both sides. I've got some two inch for there. Well, that's what I'm talking about, and then uh. Scrape that off and put one from there to there, both sides. Uh, one across the top, over those running lights. Same over there, and then I've got some some six inch red, white, and blue. I got fi uh, fifteen yards of that to go right across that bumper right there, and then uh. Maybe put some up there and there, some there, three or four rows, three or four rows. I've got to touch up that megaphone. Uh, this door needs to get painted the rest of the way down. Uh, that needs to get painted all the way down. Need to take a razor blade of that. And again, it's a bunch of details. Um, I want to take some um, clear coat to this make it shinier again just just details uh finish painting that uh scrape that off get a new sticker a lot of details a lot of details extend that all the way up to there maybe, maybe even uh get rid of that one right there and then uh got 150 feet of this stuff so uh get rid of that one right there and put it there same on the other side and uh put on on that rail there and on the same on the other side and then all the way up through there and get rid of that one uh, yeah just a lot of details like i said I'm, I'm ready to roll right now as it is and i, I think I'm, i think i got room for about one, two, three, four, eight of these in total, minus one in the middle, so they can have room to walk through to get the two on this side and reach over and get over here. I don't know. I might not get that many because I might still want to leave this back area right here to pick up used washer and dryers and anything else, or like pallets from for doing my bird houses and uh yep just got a lot of things i i gotta get started on this sometime soon um maybe sometime that i probably takes 10 minutes to get this out of here i just gotta get motivation to get it done I, i'm and I'm, I'm relatively again very well satisfied with my first attempt at Fabricating. I really am. This paint right here keeps soaking through no matter much that stuff right there. And I, um, maybe once I get some more paint, I'll uh, take a sanding wheel to that area right there and, and just sand that um, that ink or whatever that is that way and then uh, at this point, you know what? It, it doesn't really fucking matter. I don't think everybody's going to even notice that. And um, my time is really getting to be a little bit too precious at this time. I, I really have to get out tomorrow, otherwise I'll be out another weekend. 
And um, I can't just keep putting it off week after week after week. Next thing you know, I won't be fucking doing ice cream at all. So yeah, I, I, once again, the perfection trap, and I'm not going to fall. I'm not going to fall into it. I'm going as it is. Well, not as it is, but I, I'm not going to keep saying I have to make it as good as. Well, I do have to make it as good as possible. I don't. It, it's not going to be perfect. This is never going to be perfect. Uh, not with the money I've got right now, and even even then, if I wanted to be perfect, I'd have to start all over. I really would have to start all over again because there's so so many minor mistakes that I made with this that it just yeah anyhow let me jump, jump in here and uh, take a few things and uh, I gotta regroup uh, and then uh, cause I gotta get up early in the morning and uh, go pick up the car tomorrow it's at the detail shop where the guy's uh, doing all that stuff with it with the uh, paint, painting the brake calipers and um, making them look like new So I got to go. Talk to you later.